Way to go, fly boy. I knew we could count on you. Now let's hightail it back to base and figure out our next move. Not yet. Not until we find Felicity. <laughs> you know, you're good. I'll, I'll give you that. But sometimes it helps to have a plan and some backup. I got a plan! Find Felicity and plant the Baron like a seed! Whoa, didn't you learn anything last time, Cap? This ain't about you, it's about your squad! <sighs> All right. But I'm gonna tell you, the first MP who tries to take me in is getting his butt handed to him. And while I don't approve of your, uh, cowboy-style renegade tactics, they have done wonders for our strategic position. This will certainly not be overlooked by the military court. And I'll testify to that fact myself, son. Thank you, sir. And with a full pardon granted to him by the Chief of Staff, Captain William Blade is ready to rebuild Green Air's superiority and fight back the Tan Menace once more. Von Beige! Von Beige! How could you let Blade and his band of sky pirates humiliate us like this? I assure you, General. His day in the sun will not last past midnight. Leave this to me. Well, he's kind of creepy, isn't he, Plastro? Any chance you could let this little old girl out so we could get to know each other better? Don't try to egg me, sweetie. I've been egged by the best. Gentlemen, your target is clear. The Tan Army's main weapons facility. We believe this is where Baron Von Beige is stationed. Which is probably where Felicity is too. Correct. Now it is heavily fortified, but destroying it will knock the legs out from under the entire Tan Army. Sergeant Hawk here will attempt to infiltrate the factory and locate Lieutenant Wanamaker. Once he has her clear of the building, we'll know what to do. <laughs> yes, sir.